Okay. Uh, Billy, considering the missed penalty, um, some key missed chances at times in the game, particularly near the end, was this two points thrown away? Do you think? I think, it was, I think I think we deserved to win the game. Yeah. I think I think we deserved to win the game. I think obviously the penalty miss compounds it if we if we, if we, if we take that. But I think in, just in general, I just thought we we deserved to take three points. I thought. I thought we always needed a second. Yes. And, I, and I've touched on that on the way Scarborough play. You always seem to want need a second against them because the, the do just throw caution to the wind and they just keep attacking. Yeah. Um, but I thought first half going up the slope, I thought we did ever so well. I thought we restricted them to very, very little. Um, and obviously we've missed the penalty, but like I say, we've we've done enough to win the game. The, the, the thing was, when they've, they've got a fortuitous sequelizer, very much. Yeah. Um, and it took us a couple of minutes to clear ourselves, you know, clear our heads a little bit. But then we created probably two really, really good chances. Yeah. And that's I've just said to the players, that's the kind of response that you need. That's the kind of response that we want. Um, but I think I think we deserve to win the game. Yeah. And another commanding display at the back, really, as you say, the goal, it wasn't a clean sheet, clearly, but the goal we conceded was desperately unlucky. But again, uh, it was another, we restricted them to very little, really, overall. Again. Yeah, it was a solid performance, like you say. It was the goal The goal that came for, for us changed the game a little bit. It changed the game a little bit. We, had it, we, we didn't have to go, go for it second half as much as we probably would have done if it had been nil-nil. But I thought we were in control. I thought I thought I thought we never looked really stretched. We never mm. really looked. There was not a lot of alarm bells ringing. And like I say, it's so unfortunate for the lad steps in. I think I think criticism I've said to the lads is we don't get out to him quick enough to stop the shot. He has a shot. Um, it's a decent enough strike. But if it don't come off Dwayne Wiley's heel, it's not a goal. Yeah. George saves it quite comfortably. But there the breaks. Um, but like I said. The biggest thing was when we conceded the goal. Maybe other times we'd have felt a little bit sorry for ourselves and 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 maybe thrown the game away and, yeah. and not got anything out of the game. But we did. We 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 um, we composed ourselves and like I say, we, we created another again yeah. and the two best chances of the game. Yeah. That's the the two chances yeah. second half are probably the two best chances of the game. Yeah. yeah. Um, and unfortunately, we haven't taken them. Does uh, missed chances concern you at all? That we've uh, we have tended to miss chances at key moments. We probably mi had a few chances early on at Darlington. On yeah, look, look, on Tuesday, we, and we missed some chances today. Uh, look, ifs, uh, buts, and maybes, Jeff. We, course, we could yeah. be stood here with six points from yeah. the last two games. Of course, very easily. Because, yeah. like I say, um, as long as we keep creating them, as long as we get people in the right areas to to to. to yeah. To try and score a goal, because I've said before, we'll always create chances. Um, we'll always, we'll always manufacture chances in all games. Very, 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 very rarely do we not have opportunities. Yeah. Very rarely does anybody ever restrict us in in having opportunities. We've just got to start taking them a bit more regular. And, and like I say, it is, it is a disappointment. But I've said to the players, we can't. Can't be too negative about it. No. The, it's the unbeaten run keeps going. It's stretched again. The unbeaten run at home, but the unbeaten run this season still goes on. Um, yes, we'd have loved the three points. Of course, we would have done, and it would have been it would have moved us up the table some more. But what we can't is it be just be a total negative because we haven't won a game at home. Not at all. No, as you um, say, we deserve to win the game. That's that's my opinion. I think we deserve to win the game. But today. We just haven't had that little little bit of composure sometimes in front of goal. Um, we've defended fantastically all the way through the game. Yeah. Not a lot of alarm bounds. You, you restrict Scarborough to virtually not a lot at all. And we got we got undone by a fortuitous goal where we yeah. made a little couple of mistakes before that. But apart from that, you know, we've had again, we've had the best chances in the game, but we haven't taken them. No, no. And of course, up next the FA Cup away to Spalding United. We're obviously going to start as odds on favourites for that. It's mm. pretty, uh, pretty clear. But it will be a sort of cup final, if you like, for Spalding. Uh, do you think that could make it tough for us? It's going to be a tough game, yeah. to the players. It's, 
we move on now quickly. We have two good, good thing is we ain't got a midweek game. It gives us a little bit of a rest because it's been frantic for the last three, you know, yeah. four weeks. But it's always going to be a tough game if it's the FA Cup. Mm. We'll go there. We're going. We're going. Obviously to Spalding. We're going there. It'll be. It'll be a tough game. We go there with the right attitude. We go there set up properly, and hopefully we can get through to the next round and start starting a journey again. But you have to. You have to earn the right in any game to to get a foothold in the game and that's the first thing that we need to do on, on Saturdays earn the right like we did today mm. like I say we, we've done very very well of late of, of then you know of getting starting on the front yeah. foot and putting teams under pressure early um, and I think again that's what we have to do we go there with the right attitude I'm sure and and again we just we just go and try and get through to the next round yeah and we look forward to seeing you next week thank you